Hello and welcome to my channel. Today I will uh, show you the filter I have got from Freewell and um, I must say that I have no connection to Freewell. I have no restriction of what I'm saying. I'm just testing the new product. It's called uh, Freewell K2 and it's a uh, adapter and I will show you how it works first of all I will say that uh, I use Freewell filters on my GoPro 10 and GoPro 11 I also use Freewell filters on my drone it's the Mini 3 Pro, Pro. and I also use filters when I'm filming because when it's too light I must have some ND filters on my camera because I uh, usually do movies with 25 frames per second and then the shutter speed on the camera should be 50 and to achieve that I must have an ND filter so I can um, get a smooth background with the uh, open aperture and here I have <clears throat> if you're going to buy some filters I have a lot of them and I have both cheap and expensive filters and if you buy a cheap filter you probably will get problems with the edges of the photo they will be darker I have uh, for many years Kenko filters for um, for the camera with variable ND filters and that works good but it's expensive so don't buy cheap things like this they are not so good to have so I th throw them away but now we shall look at Freewell, they sent me this and as I said without any restriction or something like that. I have them for one month now and I have been testing them and I'm very satisfied. Of course it's magnetic filters and magnet magnetic lock here. They sent me some, some filters I will show you. And here I have my old camera, it's a Nikon D800E for you that want to know. And here I have Yes, there's no glass in it. So I had to put this on the camera and then I can show you how to use it. But first of all you must have a adapter ring and uh, it comes with uh, different sizes you can read it on Freewell's homepage in this case it's 77 and uh, you have just to, to uh, screw it on the lens no it's there and it's magnetic and here I have the base that I will put on the camera. You have two things, one on that side and one on that side. And of course, I, I forget to tell you that uh, this adapter is there is no glass on it, so it's not disturbing anything of the photo. Not here either, and 
you had to press in that and put it over like that and and release and now you can rotate the main and there also a water pass in this adapter and I put it there and no it's okay I can screw like this and it's no touch okay what you had to do first is that you had to put a um, filter a base filter I put it into here and it's magnetic and you can only put it in one way because there's a little um, thing that it fits in so now I have the base filter on and now I just can put an ND filter and they have um, sent me an ND filter with uh, from 1 to 5 the old one free will have was for 2 to 5 but this is better I uh, there's a marker here and I put it on and as you see it's magnetic and then you can screw there are you can hear there are stops so and you can read here it's on five now and now it's on one but that's not all because if I'm out I can uh, then let us say that the sky is too light I want to darken the sky and I want to use uh, this filter and uh, what shall I do? They have sent me in this case gradient filter like this but how shall I use it? I <coughs> on this adapter you can open in the top and in the bottom and then you can put this filter in like that and you can then see in the camera display how far down you will go so you reduce the light in the, in the sky and yes it's good it works perfect I will show you some uh, photos that I have tested here I'm now in Sweden and uh, the weather in uh, March isn't so good but in the summer and uh, in the in the autumn and winter it will be great to use this I hope for better weather tomorrow so I will go out and photograph they also send me some because I'm uh, making movies you see you can just drag here and up comes the filter this is golden streak and uh, I show you an, an example of this and then they they also send me no mist and if I put this on on to the adapter and down now I have very cinematic movie so this is also good and you don't need to have you can just take away this and the filter and just have the misty snow and uh, you will get perfect okay I think that that was all okay you have uh, this also when you are finished you just put put it on and uh, it's sitting very good I take it away <laughs> 
I put it down again because I don't want to damage it. So, and uh, now you can follow me out in the forest and take some photos and I will show you some uh, features on this. And uh, I hope that you will uh, find it very suitable. I leave the prices down in the description also. So I think that was all. Yes. Now we go out to the forest. Yes.